Hey guys, it's Mio, and, well, you can already tell what this game is going to be. So, let's just, um, keep quiet, and just enjoy the little intro we're about to be given by Game Freak. All right, hopes, baby, dreams, discoveries, adventures await. You and your Pokemon. Welcome to Pokemon Black Version, developed by Game Freak Incorporated. Look at, look at that, look at that legendary. It's beautiful. I'm in love with it. All right, all right, all right, all right. Finally, we get to get in the game. Hi there. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Professor Juniper. Everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. Yeah, throw it, throw it, yeah. That's a nice Pokemon. That's right. This world is widely inhabited by mysterious creatures called Pokemon. Pokemon have mysterious powers. They come in many shapes and live in many different places. We humans live happily with Pokemon, living and working together, we complement each other, we help each other out to accomplish difficult tasks, having Pokemon battle one another is particularly popular, and it deepens the bonds between people and Pokemon, and that is why I research Pokemon. Uh, well that's enough for me, dude that's a lot. <laughs> Could you tell me about yourself? Uh, sure, are you a boy or are you a girl? I'm a freaking boy! You're a boy, right? Yes, I am. I'd like to know your name. Please tell me. Yeah, sure. How about my always... Uh, not the W. My always go-to name. What is up with this name? My always go-to name. Frick! Yeah, extreme. What the hell? Okay. Seriously? The game hates me. Your name is extreme? Yeah, sure. Had to make a couple of mistakes in there. Yes. So your name's extreme. Seriously? What a wonderful name. Well then, I'm going to introduce you to your two best friends. This young man is Sharon. He can be a little difficult, but he's a very honest person. This young woman is Bianca. She's a little flighty, but she works, but she works very hard. I think you three have potential, so I'm going to give you this looks amazing. Look at the three of us! We're like the three amigos! The three musketeers! No, it's not! Uh, okay, so I'm going to give you a very, very important Pokemon. Extreme! <laughs> Hilarious. The moment you, cho you choose the Pokemon that will accompany you on your journey, your story will truly begin. During your journey, you will meet many Pokemon and people with different personalities and points of view. Sorry, I spat right into my phone. I have this worthless damn... Okay. I really hope you find what is important to you in all of your, all of, in all of these travels. That's right, befriend new people and Pokemon and grow as a person. That is the most important goal for your journey. Let's go visit the world of Pokemon. Visit or just stay in there, dude. Spring. That is very false. We are in, we are currently entering winter. The FPS here is very bad. There are only three houses and one laboratory, I'm assuming. Alright. This is amazing. Imagine you could play Pokemon like this. So we all know what we're gonna do in Pokemon, and that's Nuzlocke, baby. Extreme! I heard from Professor Juniper we can have a Pokemon. What's keeping Bianca? I don't know, greeting my parent? Yeah, here she is. Am I a little late again? Sorry! Sorry if that hurt. Bianca, I've known you for 10 years that you have no sense of time, but seriously? Today's the day we can we can get a Pokemon from Professor Juniper. I know. Sorry, Extreme. Sorry, Sharon. 
Alright. So where are the Pokemon? They were delivered to Extreme's house. So Extreme gets to pick first. Gets first pick. Naturally. The Pokemon are waiting for us inside that gift box. Okay, Extreme. You go first and take a peek at the gift box. I want to meet the Pokemon right now. Wait, what if I leave? What if I try and leave? Aren't you going to check out the gift box? Where are you going? The bathroom. If there even is one. <laughs> uh, okay, let's check. Extreme, open the gift box. Oh, yeah, a little card. I've brought three Pokemon. One for you and one for each of your friends. Please settle your choices politely. Enjoy your Pokemon, Professor Juniper. Alright, let's open this thing, this bad boy. Alright. Choose a Pokemon. Alright, let's start beginning. The grass type Pokemon, Snivy. The fire type Pokemon, Tepig. The water type po Pokemon, Oshawa. This one looks like a freaking wimp. You look a little sassy. And you look just cute. I love you. I'm gonna take you because you're a fire type and you're a pig. I love pigs. Except for their smell. Extreme chose Tepig. All right. Okay, I'll take that. I'll take this Pokemon. Sherry, that one's yours. Hey, how how come you get to pick out my Pokemon? Oh, never mind. I wanted Oshawa from the start anyway. Okay then. Everyone has chosen a Pokemon, so that's that. Hey, I know. Let's have a Pokemon battle. Honestly, Bianca, even though they're still weak Pokemon, you shouldn't have Pokemon battles inside a house. Don't be a worry rat. Wat, wart, worry wart. Yeah, got it. These little ones are weak, like you said. We have to let them battle so they'll get stronger. It's settled. Extreme, get ready for a Pokemon battle. All right, my first Pokemon battle. Extreme versus Bianca. Battle begin. <laughs> Sorry, I love the referee voice in Pokemon. I grew up watching Pokemon, and it was pretty fun. But this is just even more fun to watch. Good throwing animation, by the way. Alright, you're a boy. Thank you, Jesus. I'm wondering that. How come the weakest moves have the most PP? Like, tackle is 35 PP. Well, I wonder what Taylor Whip has. Uh, my speed is a little small. Eek! Ouch! Won't you get away with that? Yeah, Taylor Whip has 30 um, PP. That is pretty freaking scary. Man, what a tackle. Yep, tackle back. Kapowi, powi, powi, powi. You know what I mean. And now uh, you leer me. I wonder how much use that'll be. Please get a critical. That'd be so much appreciated in this kind of situation. Nope. No high rolls. No high rolls in the Nuzlocke. So if you're dead, you're dead. So basically that's it. You're dead, you're dead. Yeah. Okay. And you change the rules to catch the Pokemon. The, the first Pokemon you see on that route. Alright. Snivy fainted. Tepic game for you to experience points. Player defeated Pokemon trainer Bianca. The Pokemon on both sides did their best. Ha! Except with me coming out as the victor. And $500. Yeah! Jeez, man. Maru. Wow. Extreme, you're, you're gonna be an awesome trainer someday. I can tell. No doubt. Yeah, that is if I can survive the Nuzlocke. Um, Bianca, would you, would you take a look around? Yeah, look what you did. Whoa, what happened? Wow, Pokemon are amazing! Sorry. <laughs> so little, but so strong. I'm so glad that I get to have a Pokemon. Oh, I'm sorry about your room experience. Wow, you apologize after the entire thing? You are completely hopeless. Thank you, Sharon. At least we agree on something. Here, I'll restore your Pokemon for you. Sharon, he'll be like a Pokemon. Extreme's Pokemon needs to be fixed up, too. Sharon healed Extreme's Pokemon. Okay. Hey, Sharon. How about how about you battle too? With all you know, with all you know, I'm sure you can battle without turning the room into a disaster area like I did. Ah, oh, sorry, I had to yawn. I believe you're right. It'll be no problem for me to keep the room from getting any messier. Besides, it's not fair if you two are the only ones who get to have a fun battling. It's decided you will be my opponent in our first Pokemon battle. Yeah, sure, it's the first time we encounter each other in a Pokemon battle, sure. Let's see what you can do, Oshawott. Now, swap that around. Let's see what you can do, Tepig. Let's see if we can learn a new move. Yeah, we very much appreciate it. You are challenged by Pokemon Trainer Sharon. Pokemon Trainer Sharon sent out Oshawott. 
That cry sounds a bit cowardly. Go, Ted Pig! Wah! Yeah, I'm not even sure that's supposed to sound like a pig or not. Tackle, tackle, tackle. Ooh, doesn't love tackling. At least he doesn't know, um... What's this? Bubble? Rum? Bubble? I feel like he should know bubble or, or water gun. God knows what he's gonna learn after this. Uh, Ted Pig with the tackle. Alright then. Ah, oh, jeez. You're actually gonna kill me. If, imagine he had the higher speed than me. Oh man, I'd be so in trouble. Tepic gained 43 experience. Tepic grew to level 6. Player defeated, you won't even say my name anymore. Oh, so that's a Pokemon battle. You, you didn't know, did you not watch the Pokemon battle? I made a strange blunder in my first battle, but this feeling I have. I'm finally a trainer. But first, you better go apologize to your mother about this messed up room. Oh, I'd better come too. Yeah, leave my room. The Wii still intact and on. I'm surprised, for God's sake. Yeah, I'm not gonna explore my room right now. I'm very sorry about all the trouble, ma'am. Well, um, we can clean up. Cleaning up? No worries. I'll take care of it later. If only our moms were like that. Shouldn't you be on your way to meet Professor Juniper? Yes, thank you. Please excuse us. Come on, let's go thank Professor Juniper. I'll be waiting in front of the Pokemon Research Lab. Oh, wait, I gotta go home first. Thanks for having us over. The door's outside, damn! Hey, Ma. How's it going? My, my, extreme. Pokemon battles are so lively, aren't they? I could hear the Pokemon's cries clear down here. Hmm. That sure reminded me of my first Pokemon battle. Speaking of which, where is your Pokemon? Oh, and you know what? After a battle, you need to rest your Pokemon. Oh, yay. Your Pokemon is looking great. Now, if you're going out, don't forget your cross transceiver. Oh, I love it. Extreme, obtain the X transceiver. Okay, let's just call it the X transceiver, not the cross transceiver. Otherwise, it's going to be a little bit of Twitter blow up right now. Uh, what else? You're going to thank the professor too, all right? Better get going, honey. Oh, seriously? I don't have running shoes. That sucks. Well, pied up here. The pied dev. Who doesn't love pied dev? All right. So is this Bianca's house? I just, yeah, yeah, got it. All right, let's check what's going on. Jesus! No, no, a thousand times no. But I'm I'm a good trainer who got a Pokemon and everything. I can totally go on an adventure. Is your father refusing? Oh, it's okay. It's fine. I'll be waiting for you in the front of the lab, okay? Okay, let's go, guys. I'm just gonna ignore the parents. Don't wanna encounter something over there. So, I'm gonna walk in the middle of the path. He doesn't love doing that. Hello. And here we are. It's the lab. Okay, let's go meet the professor. As I suspected, it's a lab. This music, oh my god. Hi there, I've been waiting for you young people. Let me introduce myself again. My name is Professor Juniper. We know your name. Come, come, Sharon. This is not a time to take things lightly. Today is a day to remember always, so it's best to behave with some formality. That being so, that being so, once again, my name is Professor Juniper, and I am researching when and how the creatures called Pokemon came into existence. I wonder. Oh, that's unusual. You've already had a Pokemon battle. So maybe that's why it feels as though your Pokemon have already begun to trust you. By the way, would you would you like to give your Pokemon a nickname? I forgot that's one in the world of Nuzlocke. What will I name you? Uh I don't know, I'll call him Cute Fire Cute Blaze. Blaze a cute, blaze a cute. I love that. Uh, yeah. Wait, what is he? Blaze cute. I make up the most great names. Uh huh. I see. Seriously? I uh huh. I see. Are you okay with the nickname Blaze cute? Hell yeah, I am. Blaze cute is is its name. That's such a great name. 
Alright guys, be right back. Alright, let's continue the dialogue. Lazy Cute is, is its name. That's such a great name. As for why I gave all of the you Pokemon, it's for the Pokédex, right? Whoa, you're ahead of yourself. Pokédex? I am astonished. Nice work, Sharon. You have already studied Pokemon extensively, haven't you? Still, let me explain everything from the beginning, for everyone's sake. Definitely. The Pokédex is a high-tech device that automatically records the Pokemon you encounter, so I want you three to visit many places and meet all of... Huh? Say hello to the internet, ma. Hi, internet! <laughs> this is probably like her fifth debut into my one of my videos. I'm not sure. I'll, I'm not keeping count. So I want you three to visit many places and meet all of the Pokemon in the Unilever region. This is my request. Extreme! Sharon! Bianca! Dude, why you gotta put exclamation points at the end? You'll go on an adventure to complete the Pokedex, will you not? If I say no, it won't happen. But the Pokedex will give me enough information that I like. Okay! I mean, yes, Professor. Thank you very much. Because of you, I can become a Pokemon trainer exactly as I have always wished. All of you, thanks! You have given me the best possible answer. Looks like a freaking um, MP3 or an iPod. Next, I need to teach you how to meet Pokemon. Please meet me at Route 1, okay? Okay, so you just gonna leave us to, um, Bonnie. Since the professor asked us, it's okay to go on an adventure, right? I can explore and maybe find out what I want to do in my in life. I think I'd like that. Of course. We can travel however we want while we complete the Pokédex. Yeah, maybe we don't want to complete the Pokédex in the first place. Jesus. Hey! Extreme, wait up! Alright guys, how'd you all get out of the door? Oh, there you are! And, what did the professor have to say? She asked you to complete the Pokédex? I can't believe it! We didn't even say anything. Well, actually, I can. I already knew she was going to ask. You piece of something. That's why I brought you three of these town maps. Take them with you. You must be a very rich person to get these. Extreme obtained the, the town map. Yeah, 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 what else? Yeah, you are, Sharon? I'll take good care of it. And one for you, too, Bianca. Th thank you so much as for your room extreme or what's left of it god <laughs> no need for any of you to worry i'll take care of tidying up i'm pretty sure that's the least of our worries okay extreme ah uh, pokemon they are so cute why do they got named i'm lazy cute damn it but they have enough power to destroy a bedroom they are really something <laughs> they can destroy all more than that i hear i hear gyarados can destroy entire towns I mean, villages, yeah. God knows what I mean in the Pokedex entry. If Pokemon like that at your side, you'll be safe wherever you go. I'll let your parents know. I hope that in addition to Pokemon, you'll find lots and lots of places you like in the Unova region and become wonderful adults. Have a great trip. How long are we going to be gone? If I use the town map, I'll, also, I'll always know where I am. That's certainly helpful. What do you think map means? Shall we head to Route 1? The professor's waiting. Let's go, let's go! Extreme, hurry and come too, okay? At least isn't, isn't it, it isn't like Pokemon Diamond. So, yeah. Basically everything's good. I'm just putting a Y on everything. So we have to keep coming into the map almost every time. Let's check this I, um, iPod. <laughs> Boom. And let's do it. No, wait, wait. Let me go to my Tepig. And info area and cry. Let's listen. Huh. Well, I just kept pressing it. Ha! <laughs> I love it. Okay, stop. Oh god, the storage. So I better get through the map pretty quick. See? Way more easier. Let's get to the bag. Key items first. Key items, town map. Items, medicine, TMs and HMs, berries. Hey, you! Bless me. <sighs> Again, I keep exiting like that. Oh, yeah, the gyms. Has a very nice rotation style. Oh, I a bold trainer. Um, can I? Ex <laughs> I really thought I could change my name. I am trainer. I'm pleased to meet you. Damn. <laughs> okay, let's turn it around. Ooh, signature. Okay, let's do a little bit of 
this and oh no 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 that's not supposed to happen I know how my secrets are supposed to be when it comes to my names all right here we go boom and boom 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 I always do my signatures in cursive uh looking good all right I got four thousand dollars there's also the save I'm not gonna save we're already on an emulator mono sorry I, I'm just very interested in monos and here we go. And save. What are you doing? What are you doing? Are we done here? Thank you, Jesus. That, that was weird. I can't run yet. Why? Extreme! It's this way! Bianca says if we're st starting a journey together, she wants us all to take our first step at the same time. Hey, extreme! Jesus, my voice. Let's all take our first step on Route 1 together. Okay, here we go! One, two! That was like four very short steps. Oh, I wonder what will happen. Isn't this so exciting? It sure is. Come on! The, prof the professor's waiting. waiting. Professor Juniper, I'm sorry to, ke to have kept you waiting. Sure, yeah, I'm not. <laughs> now that everyone's here, I'll explain. The Pokedex pages update automatically whenever you need a Pokemon. Moreover, it's set up to so that you obtain even more information when you catch a Pokemon. To make this clear, I'm going to demonstrate how to catch a Pokemon. Um, should we just skip this part? Yeah, let's skip this part. Alright, we made it through the grueling agonizing pain of watching someone catch a Pokemon. Did you see that just now? Here's how it goes, step by step. First, reduce the Pokemon's HP. Pokemon that still have all of their energy are difficult to catch. If you can, use your Pokemon's moves to make the Pokemon you want to catch fall asleep, or paralyze it. And to wrap this up in the best way, I have a gift for you, some Pokeballs! Extreme obtain Pokeballs, and yeah, you know the rest. Pokeballs are used for catching Pokemon and for carrying it, the Pokemon you catch. I'm going on ahead. I'll be waiting for you at Cumula Town. Surprise, you did not, you did not get encountered by Pokemon. She forgot to say that Pokemon jump out at at you in the tall grass. At least you'll notice it, Sharon. I'm heading to Accumula Town, too. I think I'll go, too. I'm looking forward to the next town so I can go shopping for Pokeballs. You figure that out? Wait a minute! Hey, listen, Extreme, Sharon, I thought something fun. But we need to get going. I'd imagine the professor's all waiting, too. Would you just listen a sec? Seriously! Why don't we see who can catch the most Pokemon? The person carrying the most Pokemon, including the one received from Professor Unifer, is the winner. Huh. Actually, that sounds interesting. It will fill up my Pokedex pages, so I'm sure it will please the Professor, too. Okay, then, until we reach Accumula Town, take care of healing your Pokemon at your house. Me and Snivy will do our best for sure. Okay, so no the Nuzlocke begins. The rules are, of course, first Pokemon you see in a route, you catch it. And here we are already. Damn it, it's not a puppet! <laughs> Alright. Play, go, play the cute. And there's Pat Rat. So, what happens if I kill it by accident? I'm gonna one shot it? Nope, not gonna one shot it. I have to catch it now. Come on. So, how many Pokeballs do we have? Five. Oh, God. Extreme, use the Pokeball. Come on. One, two, three. What the hell? Ah, I almost had it. Are you gonna keep tackling me? Uh, yeah. go. Now they have this last used item thing. I like it. Ah, uh, Pokeball, go! Come on. One, two, three. <laughs> I love that. Gotcha. Pat Rag was caught. Pat Rag's data was added to the Pokedex. Okay, Pokedex registration completed. Number 10, Pat Rat, a scout Pokemon, a normal type. Using food stored in cheek pouches, they can keep watch for days. They use their tails to, communi to communicate with each other. With others, sorry. Give a nickname to the caught Pat Rat. Sure. It's a girl. It's a girl! Alright, I'm gonna name you... The... Sandy. I feel like Sandy would work again. The return of Sandy, but this time it's Sandy 2.0. Yeah, Sandy 2.0. Oh, 
Alright, let's get out of here. So, we should start grinding for you. I mean, yeah, grinding for you. Let's switch over here. Actually, that's a bad idea. I realize how weak you are, so this is not going to work out very well. I'll help you later. Uh, come on, make it. The first grass step I make. Another pet rat. Now there's a girl. I mean, a dude. At level four. Damn, and those luck rules. Tackle. Ignore that clapping. I keep tackling. Blaze is cute. I love that name. What you looking for? My auntie's here. What are you looking for? Why? I can't, nigga. What did I say? What, what did I warn you about? Word usage. Oh my god, guys. I think I need to give fair warning to all to all white people who are gonna watch who are gonna watch this video. Yeah, I should totally give a fair warning. It's still like it's her fault. It's my auntie's fault. Not mine. Alright, Ember. See PP25. This is it just keeps going. Oh god, I was not expecting a burn to happen. I wish that could happen in gym battles, that'd be so useful. Basic Q's defense fell while your face is about to melt. Yep, tackle. Okay, and 30 experience. Not bad. Level 7. I love my Pokemon. Hey, Sharon, how's it going? Extreme! Are you going to compare yourself to with Bianca? Both Bianca and I have two Pokemon with us. Oh, God. How about it, Extreme? Do you want to compare which one of us has the most Pokemon with them? Nope. Hmm. Guess I'll be waiting here then. What? Fine then! Jesus! Seems the number of Pokemon Extreme has is two. We all have the same number then. Incidentally, incidentally, if you check your Pokedex, you'll see how many Pokemon you've found and how many you've caught. I'm off to Accumulator Town. The professor is waiting. The X Transceiver is going. Is ringing. Sorry. I picked up the X Transceiver. What did we have for yesterday? Oh, jeez. Yeah, that should work for me. Rice chicken and mash. We're talking about potato mash, baby. Alright. Hello, how is everyone doing? Everybody doing? You and your Pokemon are getting along great now, all right? Oh, Professor! Right now I'm in front of the of Accumulated Town's Pokemon Center. I'd like to show you around. So hurry on ev over, everyone. Okay, the Pokemon Center. Right. Okay, see you. Well, I'm going ahead. I'm pretty sure Bianca was thinking the same thing. Oh, this music sounds good. Hello! Ah, Extreme! There you are. Traveling with your Pokemon is truly one of one of the joys of being a trainer. Please follow me. I'd like to show you the most important place for a trainer to know. <gasps> a Pokemon gym? I would imagine a Pokemon gym was this huge. Nope. Looks not Pokemon gym enough. This is a Pokemon Center. Don't you feel better as soon as you step through the door? Yeah, the music too. Okay, let's start our journey. When did you- God! Oh, wait for me! A Pokemon Center is a truly incredible place. Do you know why? Because your Pokemon can be healed. And what's more, it's absolutely free! I hate to do that for free. But I'm a nice person, so I might as well. A Pokemon Center is a trainer's best friend. Here, Extreme, give it a try. Hello and welcome- Yo, sorry. Hello and welcome to the Pokemon Center. We restore your tor- <laughs> We restore your tired Pokemon to full health. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? Sure. Uh, my only two Pokemon. Okay, I'll take your Pokemon for a few seconds. Thanks, Nurse Joy. Thank you for waiting. We've restored your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Okay, now that your Pokemon has have been rested, I'll show you how to use the PC at a Pokemon Center. Pretty sure we all know how to use the PC. This is the PC. It's free for any trainer to use. Why aren't there two? Many people will come in here and want to use the PC for Fortnite or whatever. You can store Pokemon in your PC boxes. Is that what it's for? Or select Pokemon stored in your PC boxes to take along with you. God. In addition, if you catch a new Pokemon while you have six Pokemon traveling with you, 
The Pokemon you just caught is sent automatically to the PC network. How is there a freaking suction under under the freaking grass? Whoa, freak! That was my underwear. Surprising, isn't it? Amazing, even. Here's something else that's cool. If you select my PC, I'll, ev I'll evaluate the progress you've made on your P Pokédex. So it was like FaceTime. God, Professor, it says someone's PC on the screen. Who is someone? <laughs> very good, Bianca. That's a very that's a great observation. Good question. And I'd like to say more, but for now, I just ignore that and go ahead to use the PC. What? Are you a hacker? Someone is the person who made the, P the Pokemon storage system. Bill? <laughs> I'm not. I'm not gonna say Bill Gates. God, that's a lot of memes. <gasps> Never mind. Okay, someone I'm. I'll. Sh I'm sure you'll meet someday. Okay, let's move on. Yeah, sure. Let's move. Dun, 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 now, this is the Pokemart. Okay, this is the place to buy useful items and sell the sh ones you don't need anymore. That gentleman over there. Which one? There are two. Will help you with a smile. So let's wrap this up. I've given you the basics of being a trainer. I'm going to head back to Novema Town. One final thing: when you go to, when you get to Strayton City, which is the next town, I suppose, go and meet an inventor named Fennel. She's a friend of mine from from long ago, and I'm I'm sure she'll help you on your way. Best of luck. I hope that your journeys, I'm is journey supposed to be spelled like that? Well, Raven. Proved to be the adventure of a lifetime. Yeah, I'm having the lifetime in my bed. Ooh, what should I buy? Potions and, po and Pokeballs are, diff are definitely important. I'm um, thinking... I should buy something as well. Hello, welcome. May I help you buy? Pokeball. I might as well grab... Just a few more. Ah, what the heck. I'm gonna waste a thousand dollars on Pokeballs. And potions... Five. I waste half my money. Yep, we got everything I need, man. Later. I'm not gonna talk to the other guy. Guys, we're about. To, this video is getting pretty long. Sounds like something's going on in the plaza. Well, let's have a look. Look, see, sorry. Ooh, what's going on? Hey, Sharon, what's going on? Extreme, come here a sec. Oh God. This music sounds very dreadful. My name is Getsis. I'm here representing Team Plasma. Is this Team Rocket 2.0? Wait. Oh, sorry, let me read. Today, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to talk to you about Pokemon Liberation. Huh? What? I'm sure most of you believe that we humans and Pokemon are partners that have come to live together because we want and need each other. However, is that really the truth? Have you ever considered that perhaps we humans only assume that this is the truth? Pokemon are subject to the selfish commands of trainers. They get pushed around when they are when they are our partners at work. Can anyone see with confidence what, what that there is no truth in what I'm saying? No way. Yikes. I don't know. Okay. Now, ladies and gentlemen, Pokemon are different from humans. They are living beings that contain unknown potential. They are living beings from whom we humans have much to learn. Tell me what is our responsibility toward these beautiful beings called Pokemon. What could it be? Liberation? Leave it! Liberation is not the word to use! That's right. We must liberate the Pokemon. Then and only then will humans and Pokemon truly be equals. Everyone, I end my words here today by imploring you to consider the relationship between people and Pokemon and the correct way to proceed. We sincerely appreciate your attention. Okay. He, you seem very kingly. About that speech, what do you think we should do? Liberate Pokemon? That's not that's not even possible. So y'all just scatter like that? Your Pokemon just now was saying, "Slow down! You talk too fast." And what's this about Pokemon talking? That's an odd thing to say. Yes, they're talking. Oh, then you two can't hear it either. How sad. My name is N. My name is Sharon, and this is Extreme. We were asked to complete the Pokédex, and we just left on our journey. My main goal is to become the Pokémon Champion, though. The Pokédex, eh? 
So you're going to confine many, many Pokemon and Pokeballs for that then. You're putting it in the wrong words. I'm a trainer too, but I can't help wondering. Are Pokemon really happy that way? Well, extreme is it? Let me hear your Pokemon's voice again. You are threatening me into a battle. And I'm not afraid to use my uh, special Pokemon type of letters. You send a Purloin. What level is Purloin? Frick! Oh, wait, I can do that. I can live with that. Alright. Uh, Ember! Oh, God, that hurts. Yeet! More! Let me hear the voice of your Pokemon. Yikes. This guy's very demanded. Ha! You lowered my attack! Not my special attack. See? I know my Pokemon stats already. Ember! Scratch. And I used Ember again. Oh, one more Ember. You should be down for the count. Yeet! Alright, that should be a lot of experience right there. 118 experience points. I'm level 8! Ah, I never expected to hear Pokemon say such things. Haha, <laughs> it probably said some bad things to you. As long as Pokemon are confined in Pokeballs, stop saying it wrong. Pokemon will never become perfect beings. I have to change the world for Pokemon because they are my friends. They're everyone in the world's friends, damn it. Huh, strange guy. But I'm not going to worry about it. Trainers and Pokemon help each other out. Listen, I'm going on ahead. I want to battle the gym leader in the next town, Strange Town City. At least you explain. Aim to the battle aim to battle gym leader after gym leader. The best way for a trainer to become stronger is to challenge the gym leaders in each area. Alright, so I guess we're gonna have to end our video there. And certainly I am having fun with the Nuzlocke. I'm having so much fun. And if you guys are having fun, tell me down in the comments down below. Make sure to subscribe, like, share, do everything you can to support the channel. And let's just keep this Nuzlocke going again. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye!